we're going to make these little pussy willow trees for a table or a or just a, as a just a beautiful little place to look at in your house. Take a piece of chicken wire. This is like a narrow width, uh, and we're making a little ball. Be careful. This is a little bit sharp, uh, but we're going to just form this into a ball. This will hold. You're making a frog but a frog that uh, you don't mind losing because we're gonna fill this flower pot with plaster of Paris. So you just keep compacting this until you get a ball that will fit down in a pot like that. And these are um, nice flower pots that you can buy at the craft store or at the garden center. Uh, you can use an old flower pot if that's your decoration in your house. But there, that makes a very good secure place to put your pussy willows. We had a great crop of pussy willows up in Bedford this year. I've been making pussy willow arrangements. They're already gone. I mean, you can't, I'm glad I picked them when I did. You have to pick them right when the pussy willows are uh, at their fullest and fuzziest. Uh, and uh, once, in another uh, couple days, once they form this, then these turn into leaves. So we'll just make whatever, just put, arrange them. You can use um, the regular Salix pussy willows, or you can use the curly willow. You can use the flanged uh, willow. I don't know all the uh, botanical names, but there's so many different kinds of, the Salix is really the, the name for uh, the genus. And you just put these in here like this. I love pussy willows. Make that arrangement. And here we have one that's all done. And so it's pretty secure, but to make sure that it stays and it will stay for a long time, we've mixed up some plaster of Paris. Now it is very thin and you pour this mixture right into the wire. That will harden overnight and then hang the whole arrangement with beautiful little Easter eggs or butterflies, hand decorated eggs. It's a great decoration.